Hello and welcome to this new video on my YouTube channel. My name is Lucas, I'm from Knifeart and in this video I'm going to show you a factory you've all been waiting for, which is uh, the factory of Hado. Hado is associated with Fukui and Co. Limited and they are making knives since I think 2018, so it's quite a young brand. Still, they build up a great reputation for well-crafted knives with perfect uh, rounded heels and backs and just overall super beautiful knives. So I'm very excited to show you their manufacturing process in today's video. Mai and Yoshio-san were kind enough to show me the full manufacturing process. So at first we went to the fort from Tanaka-san. Tanaka-san produces the carbon steel knives from Hado, for example, the Sumi lineup. And in his workshop, we were able to see how those knives are made. Unfortunately, the forge itself wasn't running, but you can imagine it's somehow similar to the Echisen knife makers that I showed you in one of the previous videos. However, I was able to see the hardening process, which you're seeing right now. In Tanaka-san's workshop, this is done in a kettle fire and it's super difficult to hit the right temperature here because he doesn't have a thermometer. He uses only the color of the steel to determine if uh, it's the right temperature to put it into water or oil in order to cool the knife down and put the stru uh, steel structure in place. After seeing the forge, we went to the Hado Atelier and there the master sharp Namaru Yama-san showed us the process that is done in-house at Hado. At first, they received the knife blanks from the blacksmith, as you can see here. And from the hardening, sometimes it's a little bent. So the first step before grinding is actually the straightening. For that, you need to pay a lot of attention and have a very good eye to see small bends and fix them by a hammer. The next step after that is the grinding of the profile. This is done similar as basically all over Japan with a vertical grinding wheel where they put the knife blank into some kind of wooden construction and push it against the wheel until it's uh, almost readily sharpened. At Hado I was able for the first time to try this process myself and I can tell you it is not as easy as it looks. As you can see here I kind of messed up the blade so this experience taught me again how much I should respect the craft and how proud I can be to sell those products. Many people like the Hado knives for the matte and milky Migaki finish and this is done by a belt grinder as you can see here. They also use the belt grinder to round the back of the knife. Another thing that makes the Hado knife stand out is the rounded heel and Maruyama-san told me that this is one of the most difficult processes of making a knife. The reason for that is that they use a small vertical grinding wheel that is already shaped in some kind of angle. Uh, but the problem is that this grinds really really fast so if you hold the knife a little too long uh, the whole blade will be messed up. Still the Hado masters know how to do that so in the end we get super beautiful knives from them with perfectly rounded heel and back. The last step of finishing the blade is sharpening the edge, which is done on a horizontal grinding wheel as most of the Japanese makers do that. After that, the masters from Hado attach the handles. They get it from a third party supplier and burn it in just as it's done traditionally with Japanese knives. Last, they pack the knives in their beautiful packaging that I will not show you today because I'll keep it as a surprise once you got your Hado knife and unpack it. If you want to get one, I recommend you subscribing to my email list that is linked in the video description below, where I might run a special sale on Hado knives this week. Other than that, I hope you learned a lot about how Hado knives are made and enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and activate the bell to not miss any videos. And I'm gonna catch you in the next one.